What's going on guys, Flying to Busy here, and we're back for another Pokemon Masters video, and we're going to be taking on the full force battle. I already completed round one, but the video kind of got interrupted, so I had to uh, redo it, so this is what I'm doing. Uh, so obviously round one is going to be super easy. Now, we're just going to go right into it, because like, like I said, it's going to be a lot easier than round one. So, majority of the players should be able to beat round one, and I'm not doing this with Palkia just because... I actually don't have Palkia at level 120 because the stamina st the stamina system is kind of annoying in this case because like literally we like with the stamina system we're limited on so much like we're actually limited on so much so like if you're still doing your daily grind and everything uh you're like you're not gonna be able to like do everything like if you like if you still do your daily grind like in the morning where you get your co-op orbs your evolution material and everything like, and all like you're you're gonna be so low on stamina it, it's just not gonna be fun so like they honestly i i'm at first i said yeah i like the stamina system but now it's just becoming a problem like it actually is becoming a little bit of a problem because like this isn't fun anymore like it's not like at first, we, we were fine with it a little bit, sort of, but now it's just coming to the point where it's just, no, it's just, <laughs> we can't have this. But, yeah, ho hopefully we, they get rid of it, but once I get Palkia to level 120, then I'll come back into this event and, uh, and show off Palkia with uh, what Palkia is capable of and uh, show off the damage that that monster is able to do. Like, he hits so hard. Like, he's literally the best legendary event Pokemon now. Like, he literally is number one. So, it's, it's going to be interesting to see what they're going to be able to do in the future with these legendary Pokemon. Because we all know that they're very good. Like, <laughs> these legendary Pokemon, they're super, super good. So, it, it's just fun to have the legendary Pokemon. But, who knows? Maybe for the one year anniversary, they might actually do something uh, crazy. So, they might we might actually get a summonable uh, legendary Pokemon, and if they do a summonable legendary Pokemon, then that would actually be legendary, I mean, uh, one year anniversary, uh, summonable, uh, worthy, so, yeah, uh, so Charizard is actually gonna be go down, and, uh, that was sort of a little bit of a mistake, because I should have healed with Pikachu so that he could survive, and then I can maybe get an MP refresh, on uh pikachu's uh, potion so then we could have gone for the heal on charizard as well so uh yeah i did a little bit of a hiccup there so now they're gonna go for a rock slide and charizard is gonna go down so nothing we could really do there uh but it is what it is what can you do so we're j just gonna go with the sync move unless we die here and no we survived by one hit so we're gonna be able to do one sync move at least Knock off uh, Dragonite's health a little bit, and uh, I guess we'll go in for one more attack. And that'll be it, because Brutal Swing is going to knock us out, and that's that. So now we're going to just go in with uh, Garchomp, and just finish up whatever we did not in this battle with Charizard. So, uh, tip, like, if you have a good team, if you have good Dragon types in it uh, for this event, you'll be fine. But I... I actually don't have any good, really good dragon types at the moment. Like, I could uh, Sync Grid, um, uh, Iris, and Haxorus, but I only have them, like, one out of five in the Sync Grid, so, like, I'm not really going to get anything good out of that. Uh, I have Kingdra, one out of five, so I'm not really going to get anything good there either. Um, I have Salamence, but he's not even a striker. Um, and that's literally it. That's literally it. But I do have Palkia. So, I mean, but he's not going to be able to go into uh, the round two because you need to have recommend, because like, your Pokemon need to be at level 120 in order to take that on. So, that's sort of out of the question, but that's okay, that's okay. We're going to, let's just see how I'm able to perform with uh, the, the Sync Prince that I had. Uh, so, yeah, like, I mean, the first two side Pokemon will be easy because they'll be weak to water. So, like, I could literally just bring a water-type AoE and then take out the first batch there, but I don't know. It's... We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Even if I don't complete this, I'll still upload it just because, like, why not? Um, like, there's... 
Like, if I don't beat it, then it's whatever. What can you do? Uh, so, yeah, I'll still upload it, like I said. But it's just going to be sort of annoying because I would rather have a battle where I actually beat it and get the medals. But if not, then whatever. It's okay. Because uh, I'm going to come back into this event tomorrow anyways with Palkia. And maybe we'll be able to beat it if I don't end up uh, beating it in this video. But we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. So we're going to go for a sync move now and uh, Mega Evolve and we'll be able to do a lot more damage. So, uh, and yeah, okay. So now the Earthquake maybe should be able to knock out Dragonite unless Dragonite actually knocks us out here. <laughs> he, does, he does do quite a bit of damage. So if he's doing this much damage in round one, he's going to be doing an insane amount of damage in round two. So, yeah. Uh, so there we go round one is done and of course when you beat it It's gonna come down all the way here at the bottom with all these other uh, stories here um, So yeah, uh, I still need to do uh, round one two three and four uh, Like literally when the event came out I just hopped right to the ultra hard and just used my skip tickets on that so I could try to get uh, as, as far as I can in the pool over here, so <laughs> uh, And I'm sure quite a bit of people also did that too, but anyways for, oh, by the way, for the round one, you get the three-star uh, strike move candy. So that'll be the, the first time reward. It's not here, because I already completed it, but that's what will be there when uh, you complete it the first time. And then for the round two, you get the four-star strike move candy. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, so that'll be it there. So now we're going to go to round two and see what we're, we can do. Um... I don't think I'll be able to beat it. Like, if I was already sort of struggling on round one, then beating round two is probably going to be pretty difficult. So, um, honestly, I think we'll be able to do quite a bit if uh, if Pikachu gets his MP refresher on the on the heal, because then that'll be huge. Because then Charizard and uh, Torterra will be able to last longer in these battles. So that they could uh, take more hits and do more hits as well. So hopefully we get the MP refreshes. If we do, then amazing. If not, that's okay. Because we still get three heals anyways. Because we got Torterra's full heal. And then we got Pikachu's two potions. So one of the two potions will get an MP refresh. And I can guarantee that. Now, now watch. I say that and then we're not going to be able to get a, an MP refresh. With my luck, that'll probably happen. <laughs> Uh, I should have Mega Evolved, like literally right when I clicked Heat Wave, it said Sync Move, so I was like, okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, so now they're going for a Sync Move, and I'm actually going to heal with Pikachu. And, uh, okay, never mind. Alright. Yeah, so that's going to be a problem. Alright. Alright. Alright, so that, <laughs> that's not going too well. Uh, okay, so we're just going to go with the uh, Heat Wave still. And, uh, yeah, so there's that. Just gonna go for a Blast Burn now. Try to do as much as I can for there. Awesome. And then we're gonna go for another Blast Burn. And we're actually gonna heal with, uh, Torterra. That was probably a mistake, honestly. Because I'd rather... Yeah, I... I think that was actually a mistake. I think that was... Yeah, and we're only on Kingdra, too. Uh, yeah. Uh, Alright, so this is actually a lot tougher than the other full force battles, I find. Yeah, definitely. Charizard is done. Oh, well, what can you do? Uh, so, like, I guess maybe Palkia is the key to beating this, maybe. Because, I mean, he has the type advantage, so he's going to be able to do a ton of damage. And with his critical strike nine, basically, like he's he, this guy is nuts. He'll be able to do so much. Like honestly, if I have if like if I have him at level one hundred and twenty, I'd be able to like take him here. But we we can't because it's not level one hundred and twenty. So yeah, and he's like, can I even bring him? Let me. Hmm. I don't think we can. Cause I think if we try to go into the battle, it will say uh, not valid or something. Uh, we could always check that out. Yeah, let's let's try that, and uh, and see what happens. And uh, 
Hmm. Okay. You... All right. Let's do this. Uh, I doubt we'll be able to go into this. Oh, we can. Oh my God. Okay. And I didn't even bring a proper team. I, I was not expecting. I thought you actually needed to be level 120. But I guess it's just the recommended level. Alright. Cool. <laughs> so because of his ability, it knocks our HP down. So that's going to be a little bit annoying. But it's okay. Let's see what Spatial Ren does. Yeah, it doesn't do... <laughs> okay. Doesn't do too much. Uh, what are the conditions on it? Chris, critical hits land more easily. Okay. So yeah, maybe... Okay, maybe... Uh, it's not the best to use Palkia. Uh, unless Kingdra has some kind of... Uh, unless Kingdra has something to, like, mitigate Palkia. So maybe that's the case. So... Yeah, so... <laughs> yeah, that's done. We're, we're basically done there. I mean, we could have gone in with uh, Garchomp and uh, done quite a bit there. So maybe, honestly, I think Kingdra does have something against uh, Palkia. I think so. I believe so. You know what? Let's go in one more time. I actually want to test that out. I want to see. Because we're going to go to the side Pokemon and uh, do the damage that we can. Because like, 500 damage is not a lot. 500 to 600 damage is not a lot, and with him having Critical Strike 9? Oh wait, we're back over here. Okay, whoops. A little bit of an oopsie there. Alright, so let's go on you. Let's do this. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. So, Kingdra has some kind of uh, mitigation on Palkia. Like, or with, uh, I think it's aggravation. So, like, we're not able to do, like, uh, a lot of damage on them. But, like, Palkia's doing good damage on the other Pokemon, but just Kingdra, it's just, no. That's crazy. Alright, so, okay, so this is actually what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to go in with Palkia at the very, very beginning. And see what we can do. So, this is probably, <laughs> this is probably gonna be, like, a long video. Uh, but that's okay. That's okay, what can you do? Uh, okay, so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna go in with Palkia. And we're gonna load him up with support. So, uh, obviously healing will be fine. So, like, healing is not gonna be an option, like, literally. Like, once Palkia uses his ability twice, you're down to 50% HP. But then, uh, um, like, then you could heal. So you're fine. So what I'm going to do is actually bring in Pikachu with Palkia. So, where is Pikachu? Okay, so, we're gonna bring Pikachu in after we reset it, because that's what we're gonna have to do. Uh, alright. There we go, and then we're gonna take Starmie out and put Pikachu in for the healing. And then if we get the, um, the MP refresh on Potion, that'll be amazing. That'll be perfect. So, yeah, if this goes well, then I guess... Yeah, we'll, 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 give, we'll give it a try, we'll give it a try. Uh, so new world order And then we're gonna use it again, and then we're gonna start uh, healing up with Pikachu And then now we're gonna start going in let's use hydro pump. Let's do that and But never mind, okay, so Wait, do they have that too? Why is it doing so little damage? What? I'm so confused Damn, okay. Oh, maybe it's because of the barrier. Yeah, because they have the barrier active right now. And Pikachu's done. Alright. Oh, uh, okay, that's uh, that's done. <laughs> Jeez, okay. Okay, so that, okay. Now let's see if we can do damage. Let's see. This is the one time that we could actually see right now. So I think it's the barrier. Okay, no, it's not. <laughs> it's not the barrier. Uh, okay, so this full force battle is actually going to be pretty difficult. Uh, so I guess I'll play around with this and maybe do an updated video tomorrow. Maybe trying to be able to beat it, but yeah, this is <laughs> this is difficult. Uh, so yeah, this is my first time literally going into this. So like the second time I go into it, I'm probably going to have a better strategy. Because I just wanted to go in and see what we're able to do. 
Uh, but yeah, damn, this is <laughs> this is difficult. Uh, but anyways, that will be it. Um, what do they have though? Like uh, special moves and crit rate up. Okay. Uh, does it say like what their uh, stuff? Not whatever. Uh, we'll go back into it uh, maybe tomorrow with Palkia. And then we'll go have a better strategy. So yeah, but that will be it for today's video on Full Force Battle. Hopefully we're going to be able to beat it tomorrow. Um, but if not, then <laughs> this will probably be one that's not going to be beated for me. Uh, but that will be it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I didn't complete it, obviously, but it is what it is. What can you do? It is pretty difficult. Uh, but that will be it, and I will see you guys tomorrow.